Hello, JD here, computer engineer at TCS. In this video, I'm going to talk about how easy it is to adjust the chuff rate or exhaust timing of your wow sound decoder. Now, you can use a cam to sync the chuffs with the wheels, but that requires a lot of time to install a cam and quite frankly is unnecessary with a TCS wow sound decoder. With our industry-leading back EMF, it's easy for us to sync the chuff timing with the wheels, despite how fast you're going or how much of a load your engine has. The only adjustment you will have to adjust for is the drivetrain or the wheel diameter of your loco. This will require a one-time setup. So let's go on over and I'll show you how to do it. It's quite easy. First, let me talk a little bit about our back EMF. I'll move the locomotive to speed step one of 128. Notice, the locomotive is moving very slowly. That is because of our excellent back EMF. With our back EMF, we are able to keep the wheels in sync with the chuffs despite the load or speed of the locomotive. Now, prototypically, a locomotive will chuff when the pin of the side rod is at the 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 9 o'clock locations. With that in mind, let's try to sync the chuffs with this locomotive. First, let's look at the default chuff timing. I'll go to speed step 15 of 128. Now the way I sync it is I'll count where chuff 1 occurs and make sure it occurs at the same spot every time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, Okay, as you can see, by default, the locomotive is very synced with the chuff timing. I will go and manually unsync it and then show how you can resync it using Audio Assist. For this demonstration, I will be using a NCE power cab. While on the main line, you can use Audio Assist to adjust the chuff timing without having to program any CVs. Once on the chuff timing adjustment menu, you can use button 1 to decrease the chuff rate or button two to increase the chuff rate. We used rollers for demonstration purposes, but it works just as well while you're rolling down the main line. Okay, now that I've got it programmed to be out of sync, I will enter into audio assist mode, and then using menu four, we'll adjust the chuff rate to sync it back with the locomotive. Light, welcome to audio assist. Use button one to adjust volume levels. Use button two to select sounds. Use button three to change the locomotive type. Use button four to adjust the chuff rate. Use set the throttle to a normal running speed. Then push button one to decrease the chuff rate or push button two to increase the chuff rate. Use button eight to save changes. Use button 9 to return to the previous menu. Use button 0 to exit audio assist. Okay, so let's get the locomotive back to speed step 15. And we'll give it another count. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. As you can see, it is now clearly out of sync. Uh, right now, the chuff rate is too slow, so we'll increase it, and let's we'll try to get it back in sync. Every time you adjust the chuff sync rate, it adjusts it by 1%, either 1% increase or decrease, from 0% to 200%. I'll increase it by 5% to start with. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5% increase. Now let's give it another count. So it's closer, but not quite. I'll increase it another 5%. Okay, now I've increased it by 10% total. Let's take another count. So now I've got it synced back up. 
Now I'll save changes. Set the throttle saved. Goodbye. So now that we're synced at speed step 15, let's go to speed step 25 and see how it does there. Okay, let's give it another count. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. So as you can see, despite what speed you're going, making an adjustment to any speed step, you'll get it in sync throughout the entire speed curve. See how easy that was? With a TCS WoW Sound Decoder, setting up your decoder is very easy and simple. Now you can spend more time running your locomotive and less time configuring it. So thank you for watching this video. Be sure to check out our website and go to the WoW Sound tab to see more videos, information, and check out the programming tool. Also while you're there, sign up for our newsletter so you can get the latest news and information on TCS products. Thank you.